Hey, good Thursday night, everybody. Thanks for stopping by for your pinpoint forecast. News 3 at 10 on a little later just because of uh, March Madness. So once basketball wraps up, we will be on air. But want to get you caught up on the latest. There's a cold front sliding through the state of Texas. That is going to make things a whole lot cooler and pretty blustery for our Saturday. But ahead of that, we've got rain and thunderstorms possible tonight. They've been in San Jacinto County. We could see a few scattered showers and isolated thunderstorm here tonight. The better chance, though, is going to be really tomorrow afternoon. So anywhere through this period, we could see scattered areas of rain and sure tomorrow afternoon if we can get a little bit of sunshine we may see a few isolated thunderstorms we will need to monitor this thunderstorm potential especially heading into the evening at the least thunder lightning and some heavy rain at the most some stronger winds 40 to 60 miles per hour maybe some hail could be possible here's your pinpoint forecast 7 p.m tomorrow evening so if you have friday evening plans we do need to watch things closely especially after eight o'clock that's when it looks like the strongest the activity could be moving through the brazos valley until about midnight or so and then we should go rain free other than the occasional passing shower through early Saturday morning although I think we fall dry after midnight. Rainfall totals about half an inch to maybe about an inch of rain for most of us. Those are some localized higher totals here in your pinpoint forecast. It's a possibility. We'll just have to see how these storms really come through the area. So tomorrow won't be raining all day long. you probably get a little sunshine in between the clouds but just know that scattered showers at the least could pass by from time to time and then we start building on that thunderstorm chance. Daytime highs are near 80 degrees. But then we get into your weekend and things are cooling down. We wake up in the 50s feeling more like the low to mid 40s some of us could even feel like the 30s saturday morning highs are only topping off in the low 60s it still feels like the 50s saturday spring officially begins on sunday morning temperatures in the 40s it's still breezy so it may feel like the 30s there highs struggling to make just 60 degrees or slightly better as we get into that first official day of spring definitely a forecast you want to keep up on attached to this is our link to our weather blog for tonight you can get more details there and of course tomorrow morning news three uh Brazos valley this morning 5 30 to 7 a.m meteorologist max crawford has the latest and if you're staying up late with us i'll get you caught up as well on news three at 10 after basketball which really isn't at 10 p.m otherwise have a good night and we'll catch you back here very soon